Good morning, everybody. We are in the city of Pines. Hi, Philip. Are you excited? What? Where are we? Baguio. Yeah, the boys been excited. We are in Baguio. We're about to meet our friends in Arca's yard. So do join us for the rest of the vlog. It's our third time in Arca's yard. in Arca's yard and we're about to have our breakfast. Our first breakfast here in Baguio! Okay, according to the review of my friends, masarap ang French toast and it's only 90 pesos. Tapos, sulit yung daing kasi. Kasing laki siya ng fesco, oh. Next stop is where? Easter weaving! <laughs> Easter! Hindi pala Eastern! This is our favorite stop. their shop all over again. I used to get like Christmas stuff from them. So like Christmas placemats, tsaka mga uh, table napkins. So tingnan natin kung ano mabibili natin today. Mmm, look oh. These are the different weaves, Filipo. Oh. Kalinga, Bontok, this one is Abra, that's Ifugao. This is Ibaloy, Kan, Kanae. That's your tapis. That's your child bontok tapis. Okay, tapos na kami dito sa Easter weaving. And now, we are going to take off one of the things on Philip's bucket list, which is to ride a jeep, please. So we're gonna ride a jeep here in Baguio! Yes! Yeah. Are you excited? Alright, we are done with bookends and we are going back to Papa. Papa because we have a wedding to attend today. So after that wedding, we're gonna regroup and meet our friends again for dinner. We're gonna have a nice, nice dinner tonight. Yummy! Uh-huh. So, we'll see you later. Okay, there's my husband. Son. So, the wedding is done. The reason why my husband is here is because my wedding siyang inofficiate. So, the pastor is done. And now, we are off to dinner. We're going to Foggy Mountain. One of my most favorite dinner places here in Baguio. We've tried it before. It's by reservation. And everything is prepared by a chef. And his name is Chef Babe. So, later I'm gonna show you kung ano-ano yung mga kakainin namin. I think my personal highlight, since this is my vlog, that wedding was amazing. Just being Mama, part of that journey, eight years, seeing this couple. Mama, I found the plant that closes. Oh, ah, yeah. makahiya. Next is the fact that you were able to come. Thank you. And the only reason why you were able to come is because you moved your party to Baguio. Yes. So <laughs> and that's why we tonight have to go to is Mountain. a celebration for Ia's um, 40th birthday. I'm already at Foggy Mountain. My husband and Philip are playing Monopoly Junior. 
and land on something. This tree. Land on something. No. One, two, three. We're waiting for our dinner to be served. Super excited. We have a good menu. We have porchetta. We have chicken and we have porchetta. Por qué? I don't know. Por porchetta, porchetta. C H is pronounced ka. Porchetta. But everyone has heard this porchetta. Oh, ito. Mahalam nyo. Porchetta ba or porchetta? Basta ang alam ko lang, ano to, pork siya, di ba? Sorry, hindi ko na inabutan na buong-buo yung whole chicken. Ano Pero whole yan kanina. Whole yan. Promise po, whole po talaga siya. Tapos, ang sarap niya talaga. Super, super favorite. Ay, alam mo. Pumpkin puree. Hi. Weekend naman, I'm pretty sure we can. Anytime, I'm ready to present, Professor. Mmm, oh my god. Right? Oh my god. Right? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. We are by the side of the road. Uh, malapit na kami sa entrance or sa jump off point ng Mount Yangbo. Today's schedule is to hike Mount Yangbo. And I am on the hardest part of the trail, which is the first part. Super steep na cement. But gets better and super easy na daw when we get to the mountain itself. Already at the peak of Mount Yangpo and it's such an easy, easy hike. So for those who want to climb mountains pero hindi pa masyadong uh, confident sa hiking skills nyo, kayang kaya nyo to. Say hi mama! Oh, wow. We are here at Farmer's Daughter and their menu is like all super local dishes. Okay, kakatapos lang namin sa Farmer's Daughter and my recommendation is do not leave this place without eating their ube cake. It is the best ube cake I have ever tasted in my life. Kasi ube cake siya. So imagine yung ube cake. Pero sa gitna nun talagang may tunay na halaya. Na basta, kaiba. Ang sarap niya talaga. Okay, hi everybody. I'm here at the Ben Cab Museum and this is their garden. And we are about to end our trip here in Baguio. And some of you who are seeing my pictures online on Instagram are asking for tips. Well, this was a trip that we didn't really like have an itinerary na parang solid itinerary coming up here. We only had like a bucket list, so things to do in Baguio. We all searched by ourselves, like individually, ano ba yung mga gusto namin gawin. And we just went with the flow. Whatever fit in the schedule, then we'll go and do it. So yesterday, we went to Arca's Yard. It's your restaurant that if you Google Arca's Yard in Baguio, you're gonna find it. So um, they've got good food. Pero hindi na na try yung kamote pie or something. Apparently, yun pala yung masarap doon, but we didn't get to try it. So hopefully, if you get to see this before going up to Baguio and trying Arcas Yard, then go try it for me and tell me if it's good. That's what they say is good in Arcas Yard. So after Arcas Yard, we went to... We took a cab, so there's Grab almost everywhere or it's very easy to, naman to find uh, cabs here. Papatawag ka lang, papahelp ka lang dun sa mga pinupuntahan mo to get a cab. And we went to Easter Weaving. Easter Weaving is a place where all the woven stuff. So, alam nyo naman, diba? Mountain. There are different kinds of weaves from different kinds of tribes, I think. And you get to see that in Easter Weaving. So, it's a usual stop that I do with my family. I got to do it with my friends this time. So, if you're into that, like, woven stuff, you get it from there. So, they've got, like, beddings, ponchos, wallet, table runners, placemats, and all that. So, maraming iba-ibang bagay for the home and for yourself in that shop. Next stop was, um, well, we rode the jeepney from Easter Weaving to Bookends. Bookends is a book sale shop. So, second-hand book. 
books from different countries. Pero matagal na rin namin tong pinupuntahan ng family ko. So you get books for as low as 60 pesos, 40 pesos. So mara kami na ako nakuhang libro dito before before pa na talagang sobrang gustong gusto ko. So I always try to visit book ends whenever I'm in Baguio. So search it up. It's book ends and I think they're on Facebook as well. After book ends, we went to a wedding and then after going the, to the wedding, we went to Foggy Mountain Cookhouse which is by reservation. It's something that I got to try a, a few years back and I never forgot their pumpkin puree pie. Well, I'm into pumpkin everything like pumpkin spice latte, ganyan. Sobrang hili ko sa ganon. But when I got to try this one, I was like so, 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 so happy. Sabi ko, ito na yung most favorite dessert ko my entire life. Parang wala na ako nakitang mas masarap na dessert pa dito. Oh, diba? Being able to go to Foggy Mountain Cookhouse again, I'm going to order this dessert. Again, this is by reservation. So go search it up on Facebook. Uh, I can probably put the link on the description below. You can do a reservation for either group or like two people um, they've got a menu and then you have to order it in advance and we got to order their porchetta we also got to try their chicken which is so good and the other one was salmon my most favorite from all the ulams would be the porchetta so if you wanted something different because like the chicken and the salmon pretty much parang you can find it naman anywhere in manila but the porchetta is something really new for our group so if you want to try something different but they've got a bigger menu than that so you might as well just check that um, but don't 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 miss out on the pumpkin puree pie and it's so cheap it's like 90 pesos for one bowl like that na sobrang laki at mabubusog ka talaga kasi pumpkin puree siya so that ended my my day one of Baguio today we woke up early ate in the hotel checked out and then headed to La Trinidad so we could go and climb Mount Yangbo Mount Yangbo is like a very very easy hike now after Mount Yangbo, um, we ate at Farmer's Daughter, which is very very near. So places that you could eat in when when it comes to La Trinidad, which is where Mount Yangbo is, you could go to Lily of the Valley, which is by reservation. We didn't get to reserve in that one, but Farmer's Daughter is also a good restaurant because this one, man, has the natives, the local Cordillera dishes. So kung gusto niyo matikman kung ano ba yung pagkain talaga nila sa Cordillera, yon go to Farmer's daughter and now we are here at pen cab probably going to be the second to the last stop because the last stop will be for eating again omg okay puro nang kami kain dito sa bagyo pero well minsan lang naman ben cab is a museum i'm pretty sure that so many of you know about this museum by our our super famous national artist ben cabrera so you're gonna see paintings and sculptures and wooden carvings over here and they have a garden so the garden is great for kids i guess for small kids because some of the artwork are major on the erotic side so baka dapat lang na take care lang when you have a child with you aside from that so we're, we're just gonna have our dinner later and we're gonna decide we're thinking of lemon and olives but we don't know if that's gonna happen or we'll choose another restaurant along the way but yeah that's gonna be our last stop before we head down to Manila Oh my gosh, such an irresponsible vlogger. Nakalimutan ko ipakita yung <laughs> naubos ko na lahat. Yan na siya eh. Ito, ito po ano po yan. Kanina po chicken kebab po yan. Tapos masarap talaga siya. Saka tatlong tachiki na po ako. Tapos ito din po. Tapos ito malapit na rin maubos yung cheese. Baklava cheesecake. Ba baklava cheesecake. Na did it change your life, Ia? Oh wow, you're a much better person. I'm I'm a new creation now. <laughs> it's so brunt. And this concludes our Baguio trip. Where are we going? We're going back home. Say goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Are thank we going to our home? Yeah. Bye. Say thank you for joining. Thank, thank you for joining. Blah 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 blah. blah. <laughs> Bye.